the ships. Please welcome out to the pitch the match officials and the players of Billy and Bill and the Kendership team. A minute's applause for Alan Wooler. Persuasion, you obviously want opposite. You're kicking towards the East Bank end in the first half. And uh, Aldershot kicking towards the high street end. The ball's down in the Aldershot defence. It's played by Saunders off of Mendy into touch for a throw into Aldershot. Up in comes the ball, clipped in, headed down and then swung. Well, it was about to be swung away from goal by Giles Phillips and Will Evans managed to get there first, but he, he did hook his shot high and wide. And he finds Harris. Harris clips the ball into a bit of space for Njoli to run on to. Now he's up against the three centre-backs, just holding it up into the edge of the penalty area. Tries a couple of step-overs, tries a shot and it's in the side netting. Taken short by Willard inside to Adjipong. Now to Kitella is going to try a shot from distance and it goes through a body of players and wide. Any kind of deflection might have diverted it towards goal but there you go Listers, three and a half minutes in and all the shot have had two efforts on goal. And in front of Reese is Adjipong and then Lyons Foster puts his foot through it. Ball up to Njoli, holds it up well, turns sharply too. Gets the ball out of his feet. He's got Oxley chamberlain to his right. Feeds him now. Oxley chamberlain skips past his man Stevens. Pulls it back. And the effort is turned towards goal by Jaden Harris. It goes over the bar. And he plays it out wide to Kane Smith. Smith tries a ball in. Held up by Bowden. Touched into the path of Marsh. Cleared by Harris. Only as far as Comley. Comley to Harris. Harris uh, to Marsh. Marsh dwells on it. Now uh, Smith's going to put in a ball left-footed. And it comes out, it's headed back off the bar and cleared. And he's got past one, now he's gone past Fifield as well. Can he, he's to the end, right hand edge of the area. Fifield's come back really well and won it. And Harris goes down too easily and Quelsh shakes his head again, no foul. It's a really good promising run from Harris. But now Adjipong's picked up a loose ball. And uh, he strokes it out to Willard on the left hand side. Willard's going to go one-on-one -on -one against Kane Smith. Can he jink to his right and get a shot away? He does, and it's saved low down to his right by Tay Ashby Hammond. The effort coming in the 16th minute. Another good, creative, cohesive attacking move by the shots. Mafuta's won the ball on halfway for Borenwood. It's played forward uh, by Fifield and uh, shepherded out. Oh, it's nearly shepherded out, but Bowden's won it, and he squares it back to Marsh. Marsh's shot comes in. What a brilliant save! Away to his left by his near post by Ryan Hall. Sloppy from Phillips to give it away. Good play from Bowden to pull it back to Marsh. The shot came in. And uh, a great save away to his left by Ryan Hall. Their recovery. I've not seen either of them here today. So I wish you both well. Here's Njoli onto a loose ball. Can he control it? Yes! He can! And he fires it home! And for the first time in seven league matches, Aldershot Town have scored. They've scored in the 22nd minute. A pretty harmless looking forward ball. Nodded on. And Jolie onto it. Made it look easy. Opportunity here to take matters into their own hands today. Uh, they have a throw on the left side. Adjipong, good touch, one touch passing move. Harris involved, then the ball's given away. Lions Foster forward, not only wins the header, but finds Kinsella. His header only on towards Le uh, Will Evans, who puts his foot through it and up and under. Bounces over Bowden and Lions Foster. Held up by Danilo Orsi, played out wide to Kane Smith. Cross into the area, and Oxlade Chamberlain's there. Gets his head on it in advance of Mendy and Marsh. He's of course doing his non-league paper duties. In comes the header, headed up in the, the throw-in. Headed up in the air by Saunders, headed clear by uh, Adjipong. And Jolie's got it under a little bit of control, half control. Silla drops it into a pocket of space. It's headed back by Mendy, on by Comley. Flicked on by Fifield, who's still well forward. Turned inside by Marsh. Marsh to Comley. Bowden holds it up. Shot comes in from Danilo Orsi. And it's wide and high, it would be if they do score from the corner. In comes the ball to the far post, bounces past one. Marsh picks it up at the far post. And the referee's got his whistle to his lips. And it might only be half-time, but there's a little moment of joy here at the EBB. 
that Steve Gibbs can now sum up because the half-time scoreline red and blue uh, fans is all the shots and one Boreham Wood nil. Fancy this might be Tommy Willard's, it will be, you know. Uh, Kinsella runs away into the box, up steps Willard, just whips it in, and uh, any kind of deflection might have taken it in. From James Comley, headed away initially to the edge of the area, hooked back in by Benny, breaks loose, shot comes in from Danilo Orsi, takes a horrible deflection, Ryan Hall has no chance, and it's in the back of the net. Aldershot Town, one, Boreham Wood one, in the 61st minute. They're pushing for a playoff place, so they're going to do the same as well. Evans comes through the back of Willard, legally according to the referee, and now Denon Lewis breaks. He's going to chip in the ball here, taken on the shoulder by Tyrone Marsh. And he looks to round Ryan Hall, who can't quite come and get it, but he blocks it behind for the corner. It away, it'll only go as far as Evans. Heavy touch from him. The ball's been won by Oxley Chamberlain, who's poked it into the path of Jaden Harris. Harris attacking on the right side. Pass looking for a Joe. It's not a big goal. Fifield hasn't quite cleared it, it's squared across. Willard might get it in time to take a chance. He's going to have a go with his left foot and he fires it over the bar. Shots won, Boreham Wood won. Really enjoyable game, really enjoyable all shot town performance. Much, much better. Uh, probably shaded it still and deserved to be in the lead, but Boreham Wood have found a way to get back in it. Here's Mendy, he's going to get a cross in, is he from the left hand side now? Checks back onto his right, then his left. Does get his crossing, headed up and away by Phillips. Oh, acrobatic effort from Denon Lewis. It literally flies about a foot past Ryan Hall's left hand post. My goodness me, Matt, I was waiting for the net to ripple. Great effort, really, really good effort. In just not too much on it. Good play from Harris, wins the ball, tucks it to Adjipong. Now Harris picks it up, um, just to the left edge of the area, pulls it across goal, touched in, Adjipong! Goal! All the shot down, what a move, what a finish, what a goal, all the shot down two, Boreham Wood one. What a goal, what a good team goal that is, really, really, of the, just as we're saying a little bit of lack of quality, the commentator's curse, it was a really good move from Old Shot, it was worked down the left hand side, it came back, the, the Jaden Harris did ever so well, he pulled the ball back and JBA into the far corner off the post. 11 and a half minutes to go listeners plus probably loads of added on time here's Clifton with the first touch inside to Orsi Orsi looks to give it back to him he turns inside goes down throws himself down claims a penalty nothing given 89 minutes nearly gone all shot two Boron with one throw into the box headed away shot comes in from distance cannoned into a load of bodies now Mendy will try and get it for a shot Silla shuts him down out to Comley not shut down enough but Daniel does win it in the end and it goes off him into touch men in all the shot town are winning two goals to one I'm going to update our yeah Ryan Hall with the goal kick and there is the final whistle Matt I can't speak tell the listeners what's happened oh it's, it's ball time it is ball, it's all shot town two Borough Wood one what a much needed win that is from all shot it was a performance for the grit determination in that second half there was four, there was four people flying into the ball to get blocks in there was people just putting their foot through it they looked to get on the counter attack when they could but the, the second goal it was a, it's a deserved goal it's a, a goal that deserved to win the game it was a great bit of team play and what a performance that is from all Short town when the whole world's been against them they've come up against this Boreham Wood side and they've gone toe to toe with them and they've come through it they're going to get a lot of praise today they're going to get a lot of respect and rightly so